Yo, what up guys? This is Sticky Fishy Fishing. In this episode, I head down to Nelson Bay Breakwall, fishing for a few brim. The brim is starting to move in along the wall this time of year. There's been some good action. Okay guys, check it out. Yo, what up guys? Just down here at the Breakwall today. Gonna have a fish for some brim with a bit of bait. All right, let's get a line out there and see if we can get a few. I just got a seven foot Shakespeare slingshot rod. Shimano Sedona 2500 with six pound straight through fluorocarbon. The rig that I'm using is a double zero sinker going down to a size two hook. Just a running sinker straight onto the hook. Just like that. That's all you need. The lighter amount of sinker you can use the best and at the moment I'll get away with using that. If there was no current I'd use no sinker at all. But you just go up in sinker sizes as it gets strong. You want enough weight just to get to the bottom. I'll leave a list of the tackling gear that I use at the end of the video so you can check it out anyway. Alright guys, just going to be using this frigate tuna for bait. Caught it earlier on in the year. Good bait for brim. Snapped the tip off my knife the other day but we'll still manage. What I do is just cut a strip off it. Just like that. And then cut the strip exactly in half. So then you just got a nice size cube just like that for bait it's all you need brim love this stuff it's nice and oily all right let's see if we can get a few here's a bit of frigate tuna we're using just put it through one side just like that back through the other side and then a half hitch around the top just to hold it on and there we go ready to go and the ball sinker sh sitting straight on top of it and just lob it out there make sure you got your drag set not too tight with the six pound because you don't want it to pop And then I flip my bail arm over, so when they grab grab it, I can let them take a little bit of line, then when they run, I'll flick it back over and hook them, just so it gives them a chance to get it down a bit. So I'll just leave it flipped over, just like that, while I'm waiting. As soon as one grabs it, just let him take a little bit of line, and then bang. Well, here we go. Something decent, just grab that. We're on. That one, I didn't even have to let him run. He was just already on there. Now yeah, just got to get him out of these rocks. Not a bad brim. There we go there, not a bad brim. There we go there, nice little brim first throw. I love that tune, I didn't take long at all. Especially if the light line, that's why I use six pound fluorocarbon in here. Just helps you get more bites. There we go there, first cast, 30 centimeter brim to the tip of the tail. Not a bad size brim at all. All right, let's get him back in the water. Alright, let's get him back. 
He's out of there. Alright, see if we can get another one. Alright, another bit of tuna. Whack that on the hook. There we go, another bait ready to go. Get it out there. Not keeping any brim. I don't usually keep brim because they take so long to grow. I know there's heaps of them in the ocean, but I prefer to chuck them back. Just like catching them for a bit of fun. Every now and again I'll keep one if I need a feed, but I've been catching heaps of ludric lately, so I just thought I'd come in and just catch a few, see what's happening in here. Show you a few techniques on how to catch them. Oh, that didn't even hit the bottom, and it's on. That was so quick. Oh, lost him right there. He's a good size too. All right, fresh bit of bait. They're just slaying the tuna. All right, get it back out there. I'll probably cast it out about 20 to 30 meters and let it sink down. You don't want to be too close to the rocks because it's pretty snaggy and close. That's why you got to really Try to scull the brim out as much as you can on light line without it breaking. Oh, here we go. Let him take a little bit of line. I can feel the weight of it. Yeah, he's peeling off. We've got him. Yep, we're on. Oh, he's a good fish. This is a good brim. Stonker. That one, monster. Look at that brim, guys. 39 centimeters to the tip. What an absolute stonker. Jeez, he's got some weight in him too. He's nice and thick. All right, let's get him back in the water. Nice fish. Look how thick that fish is. Absolute chunk. Let's get him back. He's out of there. Nice. Let's see if we can get another. All right, let's see if we can get some more. Just caught that stonker, 39 centimeter one. Jeez, he had some weight in him. Put another bit of tuna on. They just love this frigate tuna. It's just so good for bait. Look at that. Nice, fatty, bloody fish. They just destroy it, eh? Helps to have light line too. Oh. Another 
another monster. Smashing the big ones today. Alright, there's another good size fish there, 32 centimetres to the tip, not a bad size fish at all that one, so that's a 30 centimetre, a 39 and a 32 in three casts, and I plus I lost the fish, so that's four fish out of four casts, but I landed three of them, so that's not too bad. Alright, let's get him back in the water. Alright, 32 centimetre fish. Let's get him back in the water. He's out of there. Yeah, just a little one. Just a little brim this time. Another brim there. Small size one. There we go, there, another fish. What's he? Twenty twenty seven centimetres to the tip. Not a bad little brim. He's legal, a couple of centimetres over. Let's get him back in the water. Twenty seven centimetre brim. That one's got a sore on him. We've been getting a few lately with those saws on them, I don't know what they are. But let's get him back in the water. He's out of there. See if we can get another. Oh, here we go. This is a good fish. Let him take a bit of line, get it down a bit. Good one. He's got me in the bottom. Oh, he's not as big as I thought he was. Oh, I thought he was bigger at the stage. He just had to be caught in the rocks. Have a nice little brim there. There we go there, another brim, 27 centimetres to the tip. That's five brim for the day. 27 centimetre brim, let's get him back in the water. He's out of there. Okay guys, if you like this video, hit the like button, share, subscribe, don't forget to hit the notification bell for more uploads. Okay guys, thanks for watching, cheers.